Alright guys, this is day number five and I believe it's the final day because I give myself five days to open up a shop. Uh, I just wanted to record that we're going through the clouds. I don't know if you can see them here in the video, but look at that. It looks all cloudy. We're, we're up in a, look, look at that. We're in a big cloud right now. Check it out. You can usually see the lake from here. And right now it's all white. Alright guys, we're gonna do some final touches. Actually, we're surprising Wendy with some flowers. What else should I get? Mm, let me see if you guys are thinking what I'm thinking. Are these the same? They're different color, huh? Mm, it's kind of the same flower though, but I don't know. I don't think I like any of the other ones here. They're dying, see? So, maybe just this. Alright guys, we're just going to stick to this. Only because I, I didn't like anything else. Love you, babe. Alright guys, so I'm getting some food for the shop. Bread. Uh, ham, coconut oil, mayo. So I never know what to get, guys, and I have a problem. Well, I have the tendency of buying two of one thing, you know? Like, I always buy two different things just so I can see which one I like best. I don't know. If I don't know what to choose, I'll just get every, every option sometimes. So there's that. Got some bread, got some coconut oil, some butter, because if you put... Uh, if you put butter in your coffee with some coconut oil, it just gives you a better, like, lasting effect or something. You know, read about it. It's called a uh, bulletproof coffee. We're about to pay. Gotta have some food at the shop, man, if you get hungry. We have a refrigerator there, so we're good to go. Oops, I need the flowers. Guys, I don't know if these are dying or not, but oh well. Alright, there it is. I got some last minute lettuce. No, there was no discount. <laughs> Actually, I had to click done and there was some discount, so now it's 47. Guys, I just have to say I don't think I've ever loved a car more than this Prius right here, man. It's reliable, it saves gas, and it's nice looking. Just like Wendy. I've never loved a girl more than her. She's faithful, she saves money, and she's pretty. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We're off to the shop. That's the Ralphs we're just at. Guys, I gotta get these flowers out. Let's see if we surprise Wendy. Let's see her reaction. Happy birthday! No to way. <laughs> Since you're asking. There it is, guys. So she was happy. Woo! <gasps> guys, so I realized I haven't been recording any repairs but I haven't brought my tripod I keep forgetting it and also the computer's not set up for recording like I have it in my home office but right now I'm going to I'm going to change the battery on that iPhone XS guys my teeth are turning yellow because I eat a lot of uh, Indian food my wife and I realized two nights ago I think our favorite food is it's called paneer tikka masala it's uh, it's like cheese in some orange sauce and then with some garlic naan like uh the garlic uh, the naan is like pizza i don't know if you guys don't know about indian food but it's like pizza bread but it's really thin 
Um, oh, beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's find the excess battery. Oh, excess right here. All right, we got a battery. The screen protector. So here's the excess battery. Let's do it. All right, guys, so here we go. The signs are not here yet. I'm not gonna lie, that's something that you should do ahead of time, okay? The first day you're at your location, those signs better be there, okay? So here it says, um, order place, proof status, estimated due date, okay? I wasn't prepared, I didn't, I wasn't planning on recording. Like, I literally just came here and I, I was like, I should record, I started recording. A lot of my videos, guys, I don't, plan them it just whatever comes to mind and, and then I just do it you know I'm really bad at planning things I just go with the flow and thank God everything usually goes always I'm gonna say always goes well all right guys here's the 911 gadgets mug we're going to see all right this is some it's called 100% Colombian coffee from Costco Kirkland brand and it's uh, pretty strong I usually do half of whatever I'm pouring into or a little bit more. There you go. All right, guys. So here's the grass-fed butter. And um, it says you can do one to two tablespoons, but I'm just going to do one. There it is. Throw it in there while it's still hot. Okay. I'm glad I brought the two of them because I was only going to bring French vanilla. And like I was mentioning earlier, I have to buy a couple. I don't know which one's best. I didn't know which one Wendy wanted. I didn't want to call her. I wanted French vanilla. I didn't know if she wanted hazelnut, so I brought both. Right now, I asked her which one she would have picked. She said hazelnut, so, yep. And here, I Googled it, and it said too much can cause some unpleasant or unwanted side effects. So it doesn't smell like coconut yeah but it is coconut oil it says one to two tablespoons of this oil oh man wait oh, oh okay <laughs> never mind no don't put it here i don't want to put too much on there okay that's good that's good that's good no no that's good all right pouring that coconut oil because it said yeah i'm gonna scrape a little bit of this it said that it, it could give you some unwanted un unpleasant side effects and i don't want to have a panic attack guys i don't know what kind of side effects you're talking about but Oh, toilet's fine. <laughs> All right, so there's the butter. There's the coconut oil. I brought sugar too, but I don't know if I'll need sugar after this. Will I need sugar after this? No. Okay, here's the milk. And I don't, I don't like the coffee too, too hot. So that's kind of good. Oh, man, I got to open this. Okay. All right, here's some of this. Put some more milk. Because Starbucks uses a lot of milk, guys. So, yeah, see, guys, this is why I need my tripod, man. Look at all this. Look at all this mess. Look, because I'm trying to record and use only one hand. All right, so the, the temperature is perfect. I would have probably liked it a little darker. So, what I'm going to do is when I get to about here, I'm going to pour more coffee in there. Now, let's uh, let's try it. Ready? I get the logo. There it is. It's perfect. I don't need more sugar. Another awesome benefit of working with your wife. See, I thought I was gonna have to clean all that up. Whoop, whoop. Thank you, babe. I guess so today I set up the screen protector cutter machine, you know, the film. And 
yeah uh, we're just gonna call it a day today here's our front and again guys we haven't got the signs you know the a-frame the business cards I got an email today that they're being shipped today so this is this shop is ready to go we're on Google Maps we're on Yelp we're on Bing and we're on Apple Maps so five days is all it takes to set up your shop okay you can probably open up in one day if you're ready and prepared you know but I like to take five days so this is the final day of opening a new shop by the beach I'll be posting some videos of me working there once I set up my computer with the cameras and all that stuff. But for now, I really appreciate you guys watching this journey. I hope you guys learned something from it. I hope it inspired you, it motivated you to do it. You know, we all have problems sometimes. We all have struggles, whether it's emotional or financial or something, but there's always problems. Uh, the good thing is there's always a brighter tomorrow, okay? And as long as you're breathing, and you're healthy just uh, be thankful you know so yeah guys for those of you who are interested in opening your own insurance company we'll see you guys later